Hello again, and welcome to another episode of Gaming with Gilmore. I am your host, the beautiful and uh, totally not trapped in a room again, Gilmore. And uh, today we're going to be playing some Fallout New Vegas. Um, just a little bit on Fallout New Vegas. It's a good game. All right. So we're going to start a new game, and I thought it would be fun to try something that I read about a long time ago. We're gonna try and get through the main story and the main stuff in the game without any um, actual killing. So I am going to try very hard not to kill anything um, or let anything die by my hand. And what I mean by that is specifically I am not going to be the one pulling a trigger, I'm not going to be using a weapon, anything like that. I'm going to try to talk my way out of things and uh, try to sneak my way through dangerous areas, stuff like that. Now, uh, killing, I'm going to say, does not count as people who die due to my actions that are not directly me killing someone. So like, let's say I let someone survive, or I let I let something happen, or I talk to someone and they end up killing someone, or someone else ends up killing them because of my decision. I'm not gonna count that as killing. See, that is something I would not be doing. I'm not gonna be firing that sniper rifle. I'm not gonna be firing a weapon. I'm not going to be actively hurting anyone. But, like I said, my choices, my decisions, my actions might lead to people getting hurt. I'm going to try to avoid that as much as possible as well, but unfortunately, it, it's probably going to happen at some point. War. War never changes. When atomic fire consumed the Earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic, dedicated to old world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave this. Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world, and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar's Legion. Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam, just barely, against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn. Training drums beat. Oh boy. Through it all, the New good. Vegas Strip has stayed open for business <clears throat> under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House, and his army of rehabilitated tribals and police robots. You are a courier, hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. What seemed like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. Oh boy. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. <laughs> Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink. Dig. Hey, I ain't a fake dig. You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. Uh, okay. From where you're kneeling must seem like an 18 karat run of bad luck. Alright, we can talk through this. We can truth is. The game was rigged from the start. Okay. 
what an opening. And we're going to end the uh, episode there, so uh, thank you for watching, and uh, don't forget to tip your waiter, uh, like and subscribe, uh, like and subscribe to Sorry Stories, like and subscribe to me, follow me on Twitter, follow me, oh, it's not over. Oh. Okay, yeah, I guess we'll, I guess we'll play the game, like, whatever. Bunch of stuff is being added. Okay, so, um... I think I have... Yeah, I was gonna say, I think I have the DS DLC all installed. Um... So this is gonna be annoying. Because they give you a bunch of extra Whoa, stuff. easy there, easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. Why don't you just relax a second? Get your bearings. Let's see what the damage is. How about your name? Can you tell me your name? My name is Courier. Gilmore. <laughs> I can't say it's what I'd have picked for you, but if that's your name, that's your name. I'm kind of what my Mitchell. dad said to me before Welcome he to left. Coach now, I hope you don't mind, but I had Sorry. to go rooting around I had a moment there, there in your noggin to pull all the bits of lead out. I take pride in my needlework, but you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. How'd I do? Gah! You did horribly, Doc. I mean, look at this. Look, what? What? What am I? Okay, so I'm gonna be male. Just like I am in real life, I'm gonna be white because. Let's just leave that alone, actually. Yes. Oh, God, no. Okay. I'm going to just click the button a bunch of time with my times with my eyes closed, and whatever I stop on, that's what we're gonna play as, okay? One, two, three. Now I had my eyes closed. That doesn't look any different. Like, oh, okay, so there actually are other... So there are different presets. Okay, so we're gonna do that again. Let's let's pick someone who doesn't look like he crawled out from underneath a rock. I don't like any of these. We're not gonna be looking at my face much anyway, but, uh... Yeah, sure. This 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 guy here, he looks he looked great. Okay, so I'm gonna click the button a bunch of times and uh, hope for the best. Dear Heaven Almighty, alrighty, let's go. Okay, no sense keeping you in bed anymore. <gasps> let's see if we can get you on your feet. Oh, uh, Doc, the world's shaking. Everything's out of focus. Good. Okay. Why don't you walk down to the end of the room? Over by that bigger tester machine there. Take it slow now. It ain't a race. But it is a race, Doc. It is a race. You're looking good so far. Holy crap, I move fast. All right. Go ahead and give the bigger tester a try. Oh, that, okay. We'll I can turn right on the walking. If you got back all your faculties. Yeah, shut up. I want to use it. Okay, so like I said, we're going to go for uh, trying not to... Uh, trying not to be rough with anyone, so... Meh. Jump Look space. at that. Press space. All Look right. Them bullets done your brain some good. Well, we know your vitals are good, <laughs> but that don't mean them bullets didn't leave you nuttered in a bighorn or dropping. What do you say you take a seat in my couch and we go through a couple of questions? See if your dogs are still barking. All right. All right. I'm gonna say a word. I want you to say the first thing that comes to mind. Armadillo. Dog. Oh. Cat. House. Uh... Okay. First one. Conflict just ain't in my nature. Yep. That makes sense. I ain't given to relying on others for support. Almost done here. Um, a vagina. Okay. How about this? A vagina. 
<laughs> Last one. <laughs> um, two vaginas. I don't have nothing to compare it to, so maybe you... Okay, well, let's look at the... Alrighty. Um, so I'm supposed to select three skills. Speech definitely should be one. Uh, sneaking, so that I don't get killed all the time. And either science or lockpicking. I'm gonna go with science for right now. Before I turn you loose, I need one more thing from Jesus you. Christ, Doctor. I just got shot in the face. I'm fine. Medical history. Just a formality. Ain't like I expect to find you got a family history of getting shot in the head. Well, actually, I do. Two traits. Okay. Ugh, I did not plan any of this. See, I, I think the last time I played, I chose Wild Wasteland because there's a bunch of uh, funny stuff that happens, but I think for this we'll try not to. You know what? Screw it. We're gonna do Wild Wasteland. There we go. All right. I have committed. I that about does it. Come with me. I'll see you out. How do I get up? Okay. I just walk apparently. All right. So like I said, we're gonna try and not kill anything, not destroy anything. Um. Taking this head. Here, these are yours. Was all you had on you. I hope you don't mind, but I gave the note a look. I thought it might help me find a next of kin, but it was just something about a platinum chip. Well, if you're heading back out there, you ought to have this. Have what? They call it a Pip Boy. Oh. I grew up in one of them vaults they made before the war. Oh. We all got one. Ain't much use to me now, but you might want such a thing after what you've been through. I know. And put this on too, so the locals don't pick on you for lack of modesty. Uh, don't mention it. You should talk to Sunny Smiles before Sunny you smiles. leave town. She can help you learn to fend for yourself and the dead. I reckon some of the other folks at the saloon might be able to help you out too. Anyway, you ever get hurt out there, you come right back. I'll fix you up. But try not to get killed anymore. Binoculars. I'll use those. Okay. I'm gonna wear my hat. I'm gonna wear some armor so I don't get murdered as soon as I step out the door. I don't think I'm gonna have the radio playing because, uh... As I've learned from uh, YouTube, they, they don't like music. Anyway, so uh, that's... No, you know what? I'm not going to end the episode there because we haven't done anything yet. Um, I'm going to go outside and Jesus, get blinded. The hell is that thing? Alrighty, let's, let's go talk to whatever this thing is. Okay, more DLC. I apologize once again for all the DLC going. Hello? Howdy, partner! Might I say you're looking fit as a fiddle? Um... Thank Don't you. Don't mention it. I'm always ready to lend a helping hand to a stranger in need. Can't say that I'm familiar with the rascals. Some of the fine folks in town might be able to help you out with... I was out for a stroll that night when I heard the commotion up the old bone orchard. So it looked like a bunch oh, of he bad means a eggs, graveyard. So I gotcha. Once they'd run off, I dug you up to see if you were still kicking. Turns out you were. So I hauled you off to the Didn't I get I shot think. like in the forehead? How How did I I was in the town, oh. Anyway. Okay, so he doesn't know how he got to town. I'm a Securitron. Rob goes Tell him Victor says howdy. Okay. Happy Bye, Victor. It was lovely meeting you. Alrighty, so... Quests. I think we're gonna ignore all of these. And we're gonna go talk to Sunny... Oh, Jesus Christ. 
We're gonna go talk to Sunny Smiles in the whatever it was. Okay, good. So that button sneaks. That's good to know. It's the saloon. Alrighty. Who's this guy? Howdy. What can Easy Pete do for you? Um. Yeah. Do you know anything the about these people? The one in the fancy suit seemed to be calling the shots. Word of advice, though. If you ever catch up with him, watch out. The man's got cold eyes like a snake. Okay. The machine? Harmless. <coughs> no matter what Pardon me. Says. She thinks it's hiding something, but I think it was a prospector until I decided to settle here to get away from... Nah, nah. The way I see it, salvage means... Okay, so he's saying... You can go into old buildings nope. and salvage things. Had a pretty good, good claim stuff. once, way out east by the river, but got run off by raiders. Eventually, don't get me wrong. Blah blah blah. Sounds NCR's like good and all that, but the NCR print. wants to take over everything. There's the legions led by Caesar. Ago, they're they're horrifying. The lead they murder everyone. Hoover Dam is what they're fighting over. Big hoarders. Can find they them. eat them. Good stuff. Alrighty. So let's go into the saloon and talk to whatever that woman's name was. Cheyenne, stay. Oh, Sunny Smiles. There we go. Don't worry. She won't bite unless I tell her to. Cool. Yeah, I guess there's a thing or two I could show you. Sounds like you need all the help you can get after what they done to you. Cool. Meet me outside, behind the... Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Everything all One right? Sec. Well, let's just finish this. Okay, so I assume this is going to be more tutorial. So, uh, sit down and enjoy, everyone. Oh, shit, he got a piece. That's one thing I've, I've always complained a little bit about with, uh, almost all Bethesda games and Obsidian games is uh, the, the NPCs walk way too slowly. Or they walk way too quickly. Now, see the sarsaparilla bottles on the fence There's there? no healthy medium for them. Take this and try to hit a couple of them. Oh, Jesus. Um, I'm actually kind of opposed to guns. I don't use them. Um, I like to talk my way through things. I say as I aim a fully uh, armed rifle. Okay. That's the right idea. Look Yay! Oh yeah, it's because I didn't take guns as like Try any of my skills. Still. It'll help your aim. Okay. Shot. Well, that's a start. But I don't reckon you came to me to learn to fight sarsaparilla bottles. Tell yeah. you what, I gotta go chase geckos away from a wall. Suit yourself. I'm heading back now. Hope I didn't miss. Hey, do me a favor. Trudy, she's the bartender. She'd be cross with me if I didn't. Okay, so now I've got to go talk to Trudy? Yes. And I'm also going to... Unequip that. Whoa! I can see literally five feet further. That's great. Okay. Alrighty, so let's go talk hey to Trudy. I'm um, done being nice. So, oh. if you don't hand Ringo over soon, I'm going to get my friends, and we're burning this town to the ground. Got it? We'll keep that in mind. Now, if you're not going to buy something, get out. Well, you've been causing quite a stir, but I... looks like our little town got itself dragged in the middle of something we don't want anything to do with okay about a week ago this trader Ringo comes into town we figured he was just in shock so we gave him a pl oh so someone's after them he's holed up at the abandoned gas station up the hill some of the others like Sonny will probably stand up for Ringo if he asks for help personally I hope he sneaks out of town one night and takes a Chain gangs, really. The NCR brought them in from California to work on the rail lines. Okay. Problem is, it turns out that giving convicts a bunch of dynamite and blasting powder isn't the best idea. 
was a big escape not too long ago. Some of them stuck together so they could make... All right, I'm just going to start clicking through dialogue if you really want to read it. Uh, pause the video. Yeah, so so apparently they gave convicts a uh, a bunch of explosives and didn't think they were going to uh, blow up people. He's a convict, just without the chains. Said his name was Cobb. Okay. Ba, 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 ba. If what you were able to, to Ringo? get Ringo out of this mess, you'd have a decent reputation. Ooh. Of course, helping Ringo would also make the powder ganger. So if I help Ringo, good Don't spring know why will like me do more. A thing like that. Yep, you'd get on their good side, but people around here... There's always something interesting going on. I know that. Other than... I don't know why it took an in. It acts friendly enough, but I... It was here when I took over the saloon seven years ago. Some people have said it... Huh. So no one really knows anything about Victor, so... Not much, other than there are a bunch of freeloaders who expected a few... Of course, one of the great cons did knock my radio to the... They sounded like they came in from the north through Quarry Junction. That whole area is overrun with the... Merchants avoid that whole stretch of I-15 like it's radioactive. I didn't hear exactly. Fellow wants to get there and avoid the 15. He sure. The outside looks okay, but I th there'd be caps in it for you. Ooh. I do like. Okay, so they both. I'm not gonna ask about that because they both I'm want sure. the dam. Because whoever has it uh, basically rules everything. I'm going to sell all of my weapons. And I'll probably have to buy something from her. Alrighty. Another satisfied customer. Uh, bu -bu -bu, I'm leaving. Beep. Alrighty. So I think a good spot to end this will be to try and fix this lady's radio. Hey, I fixed it. But I'm turning it off. Alrighty, so Feeling gonna thirsty? talk to Trudy. Tell her that I fixed yeah, the radio. Yeah, I heard it turn right back on after you got done. Ooh, let's see if I can get maybe a little bit more money. Nah, well, yeah. Not at all. I'm never sure how much is normally charged for this. Now. Alrighty. Be careful. Good stuff. So, I think uh, I think that's probably a good place to stop the first episode. Um, we didn't get really a taste of. Uh, the whole pacifist thing since I've just been shooting at bottles and uh, I don't think they count as killing anything. If you think they count as killing things, hey. please leave me a comment and tell me what a horrible person I am.